sweet air of the ocean that you just keep breathing and breathing. And a tar that creates a whole session of escape. And ah, the oceanic love of ambergris. Get ready to create a superior air to anyone that has the good fortune of being in the presence of this scent. All I needed to hear was, this is my signature attar, printed by the words of the master himself. This is number 233, Suga Musk 2, Suga Pine, by Melifluence Attars. Back on the channel, I'm Brandon Therapeutic Fragrance. Stay tuned for this one. Right upon opening this one, <sighs> Dear Musk, didn't read a thing. I, I didn't know a thing on this. If I told you how he got this, you'd laugh at me. He had a 25% sell on his Instagram. I'm just punching away stuff. I bought something on, oh, no, no, no. I put something in a cart. This is one thing I hate about Etsy. And then went and bought my, uh, some other stuff on Etsy from, I forget who, was it the Dixon Zach stuff? Something like that that I was buying. And um, this one got included in the order. Instead of going back and whatever, it actually wasn't that much. I'm like, I'll buy it. And then um, uh, um, looked it up, said it was a signature tar. That, that's all I read. It, it was already bought. I mean, it's, I know, it's crazy. I am calming, I've calmed way down. Being very careful. And I trust Melifluence. I mean, I, I smell this stuff. I almost, I could blind buy a lot of his stuff. It's so good. And then um, from the bottom, I, I can't stop smelling. I'm talking about somebody changing some stuff up. I wish I could have got this one on film, unboxing it. It was just one oil, wasn't that pretty. I didn't know it'd be that good. Um, watching the Elixir Atar reactions. I mean, my reaction to this kind of smell is, it, it's the real deal every time. It really changes, it stops me in my, in my, my thinking. It, it, salah, Salah is a term used in the Bible that means pause and think. Literally shift your mind going in the wrong direction and this does it this this kind of perfume this kind of perfumery just does it i smell it and i'm like it happened to look so tired i was, I was literally I, I was in a bad mood that day saw it in the video i'm like am i gonna even be able to publish this was this a waste of time and then you see me smell the stuff everything like a light switch switched in me you, you watched it my fragrance it's unplanned stuff that's no hype that's no nothing I, my first year, I regret not having it on video because it's so cool for me even to see myself on video reacting like this to these these scents and these powerful oils from Earth. It, I, I wish I would have had the first year of unboxings on there. The first time I ever smelled the oud, I wish I would have my face of what happened there because I, I I would get the designer perfumes, you know, first couple that I bought, and it's like yeah, nice, cool. I didn't know about synthetics, didn't know about anything. But the first time I got oud, I smelled that. My brain didn't know what to do. It was just trying to calculate things like, what is this I'm smelling? And it's happened with musk, heavy ambergris, heavy saffron. It's just, it's been fun. It has been fun watching myself and these reactions too. Anyways, I mean, my first hundred reviews, I was even killed, not broken down like this, not this passionate. This, this stuff just drives me to be passionate about, about stuff. Okay, for you people that are still not wearing atars or oils, I get it. There's a lot of bad stuff out there. This is so cheap that you have to dive. Take, take your dive. And it, this one might be sold out, but Melifluence, he has some cheap stuff, ships for free. It's just, you have to dive in and really get what this experience is about. I might need to do an update on how to apply it. I still apply it the same way, you know, but um, just, I, I have a hard time watching my old videos. I've learned so much, become more confident on camera and whatnot might be time to update that one. But yeah, it's easily accessible to almost anywhere. Great place to start. And even if you want to cover, uh, dive into raw materials, 
he's a great place to start and not because even with the essential oil companies you get like sandalwood it's i mean a lot of people don't even consider what they sell sandalwood it's it's the synthetic almost has a better facet than what they sell as sandalwood some of them not all of them but um it's so watered down and the facet is just not clear that it, it, it's this is great but he gets good stuff he gave me my first uh, civet my first order gave me just a tiny little that's all you need holy moly that stuff is nasty but so beautiful and perfume so that was really cool to have raw paste not tinctured raw paste in a little jar so think of the crazy air that you get from baccarat rouge 540 you perfume people if you stayed with me this long this review think of that air that's created with the Maison Francis Crujon or um, by Killian. Both of those have that synthetic, that, that air. Very, I, I know there's some other base synthetics in there. Um, this kind, that kind of air is created with the real ambergris. And it's just, it, at a minimum, it's 10 times a better air and, and just addictive, that just drug addictive air without being drugs, all natural. That you just want to breathe, like you breathe in the best, freshest of air before the musk even settles in. So for a ticket to the show, one gram, only 32 bucks, you're going to get deer musk. That's cheap. And you get to wear this a lot. That, that's. I put this on like 10 times. I, I put it on all the time. It's that just, I want that air so much. That um, it doesn't last that long when I put it on. I just put on little swipes and mow my finger while I'm working and create the atmosphere I talk about. Um, the notes, uh, Abdullah is the perfumer. Melifluence is the store on Etsy. The, the top notes are Suga Pine Absolute, Costas Root Cucumber, Sunflower, Cashmere, Deer Musk. The heart notes are Heresium Absolute, Gold, Ambergris, Zbad, Musk, Castorium, Saffron, and Henna. Yud Yakub, Vietnamese Yub, Kaya Yud, 2002 Crete Labdanum, and 2000 a Java Vetiver are the base notes in this thing. He calls it his signature guitar, best selling guitar. Right away, you're going to get the base notes in this one. I'm going to apply a little bit of it. I mean, I just, just to create that atmosphere, I put, I don't know if the camera will pick that up. I just put that on my finger and let it, I don't even rub it anymore. I don't even, it, so that's not a proper way to wear it, but I just want that smell. And I just raise my hand like this and just ugh, bike rides when I'm cycling. You know, you're down in the sweat, you just pull this up, that mind shift, that mind shift I talk about to propel you and to become a great, being great. I can tell it's authentic musk that's, that's lifting up the pine is fresh, not not bright, dense, aromatic pine. Um, just uh, almost like the pine leaves without rubbing them and getting the extra pine leaf on there. The costas adds a twang to the top of the guitar. Saffron pops up super quick as it's meant to do. And you do get the cucumber and sunflower on the top of this, which I'm not used to a cucumber naturally in anything. The heart settles into a brown leather with soft woods. The crazy air that holds it all together is just something I never want to leave and it stays there in the heart. It's like a soak. When you soak in baths, hot tubs, whatever, this is literally like a soak session for me you just it's amazing what it does to the mind that that mind switch and just your mind wants to breathe it in with your nose and just it's like calculating like this is just good good fragrance i've given this to people that don't nothing about perfume or fragrances turned off by perfume i give them these kind of smells and it's just that they're doing the same thing and they can't make sense of it but they're just drawn into it strong people I'm giving this to like, like you'd be intimidated by confronting them ask them to wear anything but I'm like try it out I'll try to start getting some of that on video um there I mean we'll see we make good video the base holds the musk in the gold ambergris 
you are left with the musk and a sweet layer of ambergris as it dries down. And, and if you apply it fully, not the longest lasting musk there is, but um, for what it is, it's perfect. I'll finish the review with how long as I normally have been doing. This is about the ebbs and flows of air and all the ingredients. The cucumber and sunflower do fade. The pine stays in till that base. And then just the, the golden hamburgery. Um, it is golden. I was going to use that as a term to describe adjective. And musk. Musk is, um, you must love musk on this. You're left a good hour of just raw musk on your skin, which is a bit pissy. And a, very distinctive. Once you start becoming familiar with musk, very distinctive. You'll know where it is. Easy to detect. One, I mean, you EO2, tiger lust. It, you get used to deer musk. Beautiful stuff. This is about what getting to know your attire maker is all about. We've never talked personally, but he's talked so much to me through his creation and through his arts. It, it's for me, it's a relationship that's created that way with these fragrances from Earth. I mean, they're taking great care to get the materials to mix them correctly and create this experience that I'm having. It's a big part of this for me. Overall, ambergris floating with deer musk in a wonder of aromatics headed by saffron, an air you want to breathe as much as possible. Sweet, fresh, salty, and furry, all in a breath. Yum. Scoring for Suga Pine, number 233, Atar, from Melifluence, experience 15 out of 15. Branding and originality, a 4 out of 5. Projection and sillage, you're going to get a 4 out of 5. Longevity, 2 out of 5. The composition as a whole, 18 out of 20. Ingredients and price them out, 25 out of 25. Tops, 10 out of 10. Base, 4 out of 5. And then, um, sorry, heart, 4 out of 5. The base gets uh, 9 out of 10. Total score of 91. Total score. Where do I see this being worn? Um, I use it in the office. I would wear this around people, no problem. I put it on in the coffee shop. It's all natural, fades fast in the skin. Um, I love musk on me, especially this. It, it, with the ambergris and saffron, it's so toned down that it's just, it, it's a beautiful air that I want others to smell all the time, all year long for me. Who do I see wearing this one? It's a signature attar, so he says, so Abdullah, I think you're my third or fourth uh, perfume, or fourth maybe, uh, gets his name on his own scent. And then um, as many swipes as you can afford. I don't know if you could over swipe this stuff and create a, a bigger area than possible. I do a lot of half swipes and then a full wearing. I do two to two and a half swipes and then hit my pulse points around my neck and wrist and lather it up in the beard after that. Ladies, your hair, you're just gonna create that beautiful aroma in your hair. I mean, I wish I had long hair like that just to wear my oods and aromas like this to even get more just wafting around Fume right here. The projection is two foot or more. It projects, it creates just an air. But I watch people at the coffee shop and they, they don't even know what to mix. They love it. It's, it's just fun watching. They're just like, what is that smell? It just creates, just like a Baccarat Rouge, but this is the real deal that people love. Sillage, it's all there. People are going to smell when you go by. It's, it's a ton of ambergris in this, and they're going to smell you. It, it's long-tailed on it. Longevity, unfortunately, after four hours, the deer musk is left for another two to three. So it's seven hours, but I mean, literally half of the wearing is deer musk. So that's why I said you must love deer musk. To the full air and fumé that I talk about is all, all after four hours is totally done with and you're left with the deer musk, which is, that's what the deer musk is doing is creating longevity and a platform for all those things to sing on. Anyways, I love you guys. I'm out of here right now.
Whatever you guys are doing with your day, be blessed.